Hi, this is Evan from WCCF Tech, and EVG has been teasing its flagship GeForce RTX 3090 Ti Kingpin Hybrid graphics card for a while now, which has just been unveiled by Vince himself. Compared to the 3090 Kingpin, the new EVGA GeForce RTX 3090 Ti Kingpin Hybrid rocks a dual tone black and silver color scheme and has the same flip OLED panel on the side. The card features a hybrid cooling design featuring a large fan that cools the pure copper heatsink underneath the shroud alongside a 360 millimeter AIO radiator. Its display outputs include triple DVI and a single HDMI output. What's interesting is the PCB shot for this GPU, which shows a new and updated design with gold traces and a new power management system. There's a triple BIOS that should feature normal overclocked and LN2 or liquid nitrogen profiles, while prohibit support all is also included, allowing you to analyze several GPU power metrics at once. The card is going to be extremely power hungry and will require two 16 pin connectors to boot. This is only the second card to feature the dual 16 pin connector. This allows for up to 1,275 watts of power to be directed to the card, although the actual TGP should be closer to 550 watts and only custom BIOSes will unlock the higher power limits. This should be expected since EVGA is targeting LN2 and serious overclockers for this beast. The change of PCB also means that existing hydro copper water blocks will not be compatible with the new card, which means that users who are planning to upgrade to the TI model will have to purchase brand new water blocks for the water cooling loops. The card is expected to be priced at a very high premium over its already outrageous 1999 US price model of the reference model. But what do you think? Would you grab this card if it's in stock and a reasonable price? Let us know in the comments down below and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon for more fantastic tech news.